Welcome back to part 2 of Watch Waddle's tutorial for a stop motion app's green screen program. In our first video, we looked at setting up and showed you some basic examples. Now, we're going to get more into some tricks, and this time, we're going to utilize some of our own personal photos. Our first trick is one of the most basic, and that's getting into the background. Here's a picture I took of an old 1950s television set. By carefully placing your cutout, or whatever it is you use, you can give the illusion of being right there into the picture. It's the Europe the Frog Show! Ah! Our second trick, we admit we came up with totally by accident. By using the sensitivity level, which controls how strong or weak your camera will pick up your image, it can lead to some nifty ideas. For example, now you see me? Now you don't! With the right background, you can create some ghostly effects. Finally, we're going to show you how to get your backgrounds into the act. Being that these are just still images, one can use multiple pictures to illustrate all about movement. Then, just add some lively characters and you got yourself a zany run. These ideas and more could lead to some pretty big productions, and speaking of big productions, watch for part 3 coming soon, as we will show you tricks to make one of stop motion animation's greatest accomplishment, the giant monster movie.